Congrats on beating the children on lockout. Thanks, guys. That means a lot. I want you guys to know that that means a lot to me. Okay. I'm gonna go to bed. I'm tired. 10 p.m. Pam's already in bed, dude. First she teleported, now she's here. How did that work? Thank you, Blue. And welcome back. You probably saw my amazing gameplay during the egg hunt. Coleslaw. Amazing. Did I call her Pam again? Did I <laughs> Fuck. Guys, don't, don't, don't do that in real life. Coleslaw is nectar of the gods? Uh, no. No, it really isn't. I mean, it's pretty good, but... Coleslaw, nectar of the gods? You probably just like mayonnaise. I also like mayonnaise. I mean, it's one of my favorite instruments, but... Whoa, whoa, whoa. We will not have mayonnaise slander in the chat. Mayonnaise is an instrument, yeah. If you try hard enough, anyways. Why did you guys not loot all of this? Do I not come out when it's raining? You're eating coleslaw right now? Bro, coincidence? Did you also watch the Queen of Sauce? Queen of Sauce is one of my favorite shows. Okay, um, I'm gonna plant some of my seeds right over here. I have to do some manual labor, chat. Embarrassing, I know. Don't make fun of me. Haha, uh -huh, Loka's doing manual. No, please, no. Okay, luckily it's raining. Inventory's full. Oh god. I'll put a bunny over there. And a flamingo over there. Last F1 race this weekend, by the way, guys, before the summer stop. Apparently the F1 guys get like a month off work. I mean, to be fair, they must live a really hard life, you know. They need some time to spend all that money. Not the engineers, though. The guys working on the actual cars probably still have to come into work every day. Probably seven days a week. Ah, nice, Altron. You finished Dredge? That game was excellent. Really fun. Okay. F1 brakes get pretty hot. Oh, yeah, they do. Like a thousand degrees plus, Morty. Except it was raining this morning because it was in Belgium, right? So th this week's race is in Belgium. I mean, why would anybody do a race there, first off? Oh, yeah. Um, furniture can't be placed here. Do I have to place it indoors? Oh, yeah. I'll put my rake over here. It's a good spot. Looks good. I can put my decorative box over here. My banner. Very nice.
Good waffles in Belgium? True. Belgian chocolate waffles beer? Pretty good. Yeah, I'm gonna try and buy Pam a house. Not my wife, Chet. Her mom. It's a bit confusing, I get it. Um... I mean, it's not confusing to you guys. Mostly just me, but... Oh, I did plant the seeds over there. Good. I'm gonna spend half a million gold, I think, on that. <laughs> no, I don't really slander Belgium. That would be mean. I guess I'll just sell all of these straight up. Um, is Verstappen the best because he's Dutch? Absolutely. That's the only reason. Put me in a racing car, I'll be going just as fast, chat. No experience whatsoever. <laughs> I've driven my own car and it, it goes pretty fast. I don't usually accelerate in the corners, but I can do it, maybe. Okay. Must be kind of fun, though. Yeah, apparently with Formula One cars, they have like the right foot for the accelerator and then the left foot for the brake. Just like with a regular car. <laughs> No, don't do that, chat. Don't do it. That's dangerous. Don't do that. Stop it. Stop breaking with your... No. Use your right foot for both. But apparently that is what they use, yeah. Mm -mm 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 -mm. Gotta hit the apex in every corner? Of course. More Iridium Bars. Cool. Of all the StarCraft 2 drivers, you bet that Demu is the fastest? You think Demu would be the best Formula 1 driver? I don't even think Demu has a driver's license. I have no idea if he does, but... I would not be surprised if he doesn't. You think Demu would be really good in a car? You're probably right. Demu's one of those guys who's good at every game he plays, I feel like. You know, like, uh, there's guys out there that are good at, like, every game they've ever played? Yeah, there's some people like that. Verstappen didn't have a license when he started driving for Toro Rosso? That's true. We call them reverse locos. Yeah, that's the... Clinical term. Mm -mm -mm. For stopper shouldn't have been in an F1 car in high school. Controversial opinion. I mean, looks like the FIA agrees with you because they've changed the rules. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, for stopper was a little too good. Probably not a great idea, though. No. Love the music. Really? Perfect.
little ad break playing, apparently. Okay. More fertilizing. More star seed. I need to bring some more paths tomorrow. More paths, more iridium sprinklers, and some more scarecrows. God, this is like the Excel spreadsheet of the game, isn't it? Perfectly straight, efficient, lovely stuff. They've made this specifically for the German Stardew Valley players. And the engineers. This is specifically made for the efficiency crowd. The accountants, the engineers, mathematicians. That's all I got. Not for me, not for me, but I do still appreciate it. I mean, I did study engineering for a while, but then I realized it involved engineering. I was like, eh. Don't know about this one. No, I'm loco, you idiot! Nobody saw that. Uh, wrong, wrong seat. Okay, here we go. Star fruit time. Okay. This is gonna make so much stupid money. My dude is gonna be a multi-millionaire. Unless I buy a house for the people in the community. I'm gonna go buy a house for the people in the community. Um, I think I'm actually gonna continue onwards with a little bit more over here. There's a load of games to play, Cilio. Yeah. So in August, I'm actually not gonna be here for like two weeks. Because we've got the Gamers Aid tournament. And I'm also gonna go on holiday. So it's gonna be a little bit of a messy couple of weeks. I'll probably have to catch up on a few games, but we'll be okay. I have not been on holiday in ages. It's gonna be fun. Last time I took time off streaming and making YouTube videos and stuff was... I think in January. Been a bit. What's this alignment? No, 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 it's good, it's good. It'll make sense when we got there. Or when we, uh, yeah, yeah. I just need to get one more sprinkler. Oh, what? <clears throat> Kill him. Kill him dead! Excellent. Something's wrong. I know, Echo Steel. Please don't make fun of me. I got some wild bait. Okay, back to the valley. Ba -ba -da -ba -da -ba -ba. We'll go back. How can it be raining over here, but not on the island? How's that possible, Chet? Bullying streamer is one of Twitch Jet's favorite pastimes, Cloudran. Yeah, it's very true. Mm -mm 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 -mm. That game wants 20 golden walnuts. I don't have any. Although I have to still go through um, the volcano. I almost made it to the end once, apparently, but then I didn't. 
Uh, we need to get some more coal. Where's my wood? Where's my wood? Huh. Am I blind? No. Well, maybe a little, but... There's my iridium. And then I'm gonna go ahead and... There we go. Throw those in there. Do we want to do any refining over here? Nah, we'll let it accumulate. Actually, I should probably... Yeah. I'll do a little bit of refining. Automating this would be so lovely. I'm gonna need about 600,000 to upgrade Pam's house. It's 500k plus like 950 wood if I recall correctly. So it's kind of a lot of wood. Although the wood isn't super pricey. I think it's 50 each. <sighs> oh, I got 56k today? I don't even remember what I sold. That's quite the flex, isn't it? Please be impressed by me, chat. My entire ego is dependent on what you guys think of my video game experiences. <laughs> Get off of me, woman! <laughs> that was an accident. Look, I got bad news. Oh no. Are you gonna make fun of me? I sh Did I call her Pam again? No, I didn't. Did I? Penny. Penny is like the more modern version of Pam. Pam, Pam! My Michael Scott impression is not very good. Pam, Pam! I don't know exactly what he does. It's been a long time since I've seen that episode. Sup, lads? How are y'all doing? Find some beautiful, lovely truffles. It's Penelope Loco. It rhymes with Antelope. That seems okay. This place is looking nice. I like this a lot. Okay. Um. There are so many anime mods for this game. Oh yeah. It's basically all anime mods, dude, for this game. Ooh. Um... Is it possible to play this game and not be a weep? Is it possible to watch anime and not be a weep? Um... What else do I need? Some more scarecrows. Oh, I'm out of fiber. Okay. Is it possible to watch my stream and not be a weep? I don't know. What's wrong with being a weep? Nothing. It's just that I got kicked out by the weep community. They said I wasn't a real weep. I will have you know that I've watched dozens of anime episodes.
Um, I would like to do a community upgrade. 950 wood. Okay. Can I afford this? I can afford it. I'm gonna be kind of broke now, but... No! Fuck! I... S I b I will sell some of this shit back. I'm still gonna be short. Fuck me, dude. I probably shouldn't be doing that anyways. Nah, I probably shouldn't be doing this anyways. No, I should have a little bit of pocket change too, chat. Never spend all your money on buying your mother-in-law a house, chat. <laughs> Especially not as a secret. I don't recommend going in debt to buy your mother-in-law a house. I know a lot of you need to uh, be aware of this. A lot of the Japanese guys watch anime with English dubs? Really? Or I mean, nani? Okay, here we go. Die. 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 Good. We need a little bit more death over here. Die. 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 Good. 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 I'm a Reaper. Yeah, from Overwatch. Exactly. You guys know Overwatch? Me neither. I need a few more Scarecrows just for symmetry's sake. Which, let's be honest, is the most important sake of them all. What's going on, meerkats? How are you doing today? Meerkat's already blessing us with his presence? At only 345? Did you get fired? Must be getting fired, Chad. Let's go down Drone Rush. Hello, hello. Okay. How are you doing, Drone Rush? Hello, hello. You just got home from bouldering? Damn. Yeah, he's from, uh, he's from Switzerland, so they have to do a lot of climbing over there. Just basic survival 101. In the Netherlands, we learn how to swim. Because of all the water. In Switzerland, they learn how to climb. Because of all the mountains. Switzerland. You doing good? Nice. Are you guys just flexing with how German you are right now? Bitte, bitte geil. I thought the Swiss learned yodeling and making chocolate. They yodel in Switzerland? <sighs> All of Europe is the same anyways, dude. Don't worry about it. They do? It's a mandatory morning yodel? Mandatory morning yodel sounds like... A very unfamily friendly thing. 
All of Europe is the same. It's true. Europe is one big country with the same culture everywhere. I was actually surprised by that cipher. I learned this when we had a StarCraft 2 tournament in a theme park that had a lot of water slides. <laughs> Don't worry, it's a bit strange. There was this StarCraft event called the Tropical Islands in Berlin, in this like indoor water park. And I learned, because there were a lot of swimming pools and like water slides and the whole shebang, right? I learned that apparently in some places around the world, kids do not learn how to swim. This was like a surprise to me, because in the Netherlands, like, Basically, as soon as you can walk, you're almost mandated to learn how to swim because there's genuinely a lot of water. And I learned that apparently a lot of the Koreans do not know how to swim. Like a lot of Koreans just do not know. Yeah, we even had it in school. In the Netherlands, we, we, we even had lessons, swimming lessons in school. Now, I understand that there's some landlocked countries <laughs> where water may not be that important, but... Yeah, still did never really occur to me that uh, this wasn't a global thing. You never learned how to swim? You could probably figure it out, Cilio. We were never taught at school, it was an optional thing. For folks who wanted to swim competitively? Ah, okay. No, no, Korea is definitely not landlocked. No. You're an S-tier swimmer, you got that Phelps built. <laughs> you have really short legs, really long arms. I don't know, I don't know what the Phelps build is like, but... You're a torpedo? Alright. <laughs> I don't know if they allow any motors or, you know... Anything like that when you're actually swimming competitively. The Phelps build comes with free gills. Would not be surprised. <laughs> Wept toes. <laughs> Web toes. Very, very long arms. Pre-installed flippers. Somehow. Really long feet. Yeah, I guess Black Sosony. There's just a lot of water in the Netherlands in general, man. Like a lot of neighborhoods have like, you know, just like bits of water in between places. <laughs> in between homes and like for decorations that were, I don't know, ice skating in the winter and that sort of thing. Fishing. There's a lot of fishing lately. I've noticed a lot of fishing. I don't know why suddenly half of the Dutch guys have picked up fishing, but it's been very popular over the last, uh, I want to say, two, three years. What's going on, Shadarki? Hello, hello. Are they gonna turn into giant ones, or do I do I just wait? I should look up the giant mechanics. Giant vegetable uh, Stardew. At the start of each day, every possible three x three crop, including overlaps, has a one percent chance. Okay. All right, I see. So we just sort of let it chill. Giant Vegetable was your nickname in college? Really? 
like a cauliflower? It's a bit strange, but fair enough. Good for you. Okay, here we go. I would like to make some more things. And also a couple more of these. Because I need to get some money so I can go ahead and buy Pam a house. I think it'll probably upgrade her trailer to a place. Like a, like a, like a house. Although I don't really know. I'm sure she'll be very grateful, Chet. Like, upgrading people's homes when not asked to do so is considered nice, right? She better be grateful. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I'm sure she will be very grateful. What could possibly go wrong? Okay. I've got all the stuff over here. I am mostly done with the island section, so I'm gonna just throw this over here. Um, I guess I'll leave my coal in the chest. There we go. Put the iridium in there. And I guess we'll have to make ourselves up for a trip down towards um, the island. I would like to complete the volcano section. I'm gonna need to make some food for that, so I don't really know what my best bet is there, but maybe I shouldn't have sold all my food. Ha! Huh. You started playing two days ago. What should you focus on? You get dizzy with all the stuff going on? Easiest thing to focus on, I think, is the community center. The community center is like a relatively nice thing that you can um, complete that gives you like a pretty good goal to aim for. You know those television ads when somebody buys their significant other a car and puts a bow on it? Every time my wife sees those ads, she tells me I'd be killed if I bought a car without her consent. I th that sounds like an American thing, is it? Man, I'll be honest with you, man. I don't think I've ever seen an ad like that. Making uh, crazy financial decisions without informing your spouse sounds like a bad idea. <laughs> I don't know, but you probably should not be doing that. Here you go, honey. A financial responsibility for the next six years. <laughs> <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> it's the same way like you see those videos of people like getting a puppy or a kitten for Christmas. I, I you no, know, that doesn't sound like a great idea. No. <laughs> that it sounds super American. Yeah, I don't know. It always happens around Christmas. <laughs> you don't know what to buy your spouse? Just buy them a vehicle. <laughs> God. Jeez. Yeah, no, that's... What if it's a gift? Gifting a financial responsibility seems a bit funny. Unless, obviously, they already wanted one. Or if they, you know, really wanted to get a, a cat or whatever, but just... Showing up with a cat seems like a bit of a strange thing. This year, my gift to you is... Financial debt. Wow, thank you so much. Love it. Oh, they even say something like, Give your family safety with this newly rated five... St oh, I can't, I can't, I see what you mean.
Yeah, but even if you're buying one that is paid for in advance, and your wife doesn't know, I mean, unless you have, you know, stupid money where things don't matter, buying something that expensive without informing your partner seems a bit weird, no? I do always like those videos, though. Where it's like, you know, somebody that always wanted to get a cat or a puppy or whatever, finally getting one and they didn't realize they were getting it. Then I do really like those videos, yeah. What's going on, Oslea? I just started playing this game. How did you get all that on your farm? I've been playing this game for a bit. A little bit. <laughs> I remember that sis admin. Could you pull that one up if you can find it? That would be amazing. That was an amazing threat. I still can't believe that that oh my god, that Reddit post was something special. One of the most ridiculous things I've ever read on the internet. I forgot about that. Um, I guess I'll throw my Iridium bar in there. And then I'm gonna go and head on over to Robbins to buy a house for Penny's mom. This is fine. It's not a problem. It costs me 500,000 gold. There they are. Look, this is Penny and her mom. Do you think they'll say hi? No. No, nobody, nobody greets each other in the street here, man. They just pretend like they don't know each other. Loco, you won't buy your wife a car, but you'll give your mother-in-law a house? Yes. Yes, that's what I'm gonna do. This is a paid-for house now. <laughs> that was successful. It did kind of look like Penny and Pam. Like, she- she was handed something, man. <laughs> they just bumped into each other and then continued walking? That was a bit strange. Maybe there's something very sinister going on in the Stardew Valley. I don't know. Alright, um, this is the biggest purchase I've ever made. I think. That's so generous of you, I'll start working on the upgrade tomorrow, it should take around three days. <sighs> okay. I don't know if I can find this. Um. Uh, I don't think I can find this. But the dog story on Watch the Circle Jerk was so funny. Ah, uh, no, I can't find it. It was one of the worst Reddit threats I've ever seen in my life. Yeah, it takes three days to build this house. It's amazing. I don't know if you want your house to be built though in three days. Yeah, I was just thinking the same thing. If your contractor guarantees that they can build your house in three days time... I don't know, guys. I have seen a video actually with like, yeah, yeah, those those small homes, like those prefabricated homes that they basically just have to put the walls up and then like... I watched a really cool video on that. Yeah. It actually seemed a lot more reasonable than I thought. Loco's new video is up. Hey, what's going on, Gabe? Is it? Now, I know I featured these two pro gamers a lot. Especially it is. It is. Um, okay, we're gonna go ahead and prepare for the little trip down to the mines. I should probably get that fancy ring. Iridium band? I need Solar Essence and Void Essence. 
I think I can sometimes buy them in the... I should probably have that. I actually haven't been here in a while. I forgot about that. You're too sensitive? I don't care. Care to buy something? Yes. I don't know how many of these things I need. I'll buy that too, I guess. Yeah, so this thing is 2 million gold. I need Void Essence and the other thing. I also need 5 Iridium Bars, it's kind of a lot. Why is the sewer green? We don't talk about the sewer. Uh, let's see. I'm gonna spend the rest of my money on feeding my animals. I have seven dollars to my name. Five Iridium Bars for a ring. Yeah, a lot of it is wasted, I guess. At some point in this game, like, initially you're farming everything yourself, but at some point you just buy everything with gold. Is this what rich people do in real life? You just let other people do everything in exchange for money? Okay. Uh, I guess I'm gonna sell the wool just straight up. I'll make a round of some dinosaur mayonnaise. So I have some money again. Uh, not today, Omi. Or Ohomi. It's a very difficult name to pronounce. What's up, Weebuck? Yeah, my character has 7G to his name. 7 gold. What's going on, Echo? Is this a gamer-friendly stream? This is a gamer-friendly stream. It sure is. Are you a gamer, Echo Soldier? Oh, I already have enough of those. Nice. I'm not sure that you're a gamer. You might be a fake gamer. Your mom knew? Wait, your mom flexed on you that she knew Prince? <laughs> like, Prince the artist? Like, one of the most famous artists in the world? <laughs> that is quite the flex. What's going on, Tacian? How are you? Welcome. Um, I'm gonna need to get that ring. Anything else I can wear? Man, I'm really tight with Marnie. I had no idea. Um... Emits a constant light and also... I don't know what two rings are the, the, the most efficient ones to have. Occasionally shields the wearer from damage. That sounds kind of nice. Cuts the duration of negative status effects. Occasionally infuses the warrior or the wearer rather with warrior energy after slaying a monster. When enemies damage you, they will take damage themselves. Emits a constant light and also increases your radius. I think I kind of like the glowstone ring. Yeah, and I'm going to switch this one out for a new one.
We'll get the Iridium one for that. You can technically put one more farming piece at the top of each of those rows and still have access from the backside. Yeah, I know. I kind of just set it up like this because I thought it looked pretty. Yeah, I was thinking the same thing. What good does warrior energy do if I already have slain the enemy? I'm just gonna, I'm just gonna go ahead and sell all of this. There we go. I'm gonna need a bunch of iridium bars. And then I guess I'm mostly maxed out. What's going on, Woker, Texas? How are you? I'm doing all right. Long time not visiting Twitch. Oh, you've been following the channel. Sorry, I just creeped on your nickname. You've been following the channel since 2017. Quite a while ago. I'm a bit of a creeper, yeah. I'm stalking. Yeah, yeah, I stalk my audience. <laughs> you learned how to make bread. Okay. Uh, I'm gonna need to make some food over here that will be useful. What is the best food you can have in this game? I'm not making any, um, hmm. I'm not making any cheese anymore. I used to have cheese. Yeah, I'm not making any cheese anymore. Can I eat the dinosaur mayonnaise? That's probably good. What about the truffle oil? Can I just... That one is drinkable, but a bit pricey. Can I drink the wine? Yeah, cheese is probably the best, but I don't have any cheese. Hmm. Actually a problem. No! God. F fudge. Sorry. Nobody saw that. Casually snacking on a, a jar of mayonnaise? I feel like you're judging me right now. Just let me do in my free time what I want to do, okay? I guess I'll just take strawberries. I can take a stack of uh, strawberries like that. Do you think Pam is going to be happy with the house I'm buying her? I don't think she's going to be happy. She'll probably be offended of something. Yeah, she's probably gonna be drunk and then she doesn't realize. She drives the cars and, you know. Why did we make the lady that drinks all day? The truck driver. I wonder if there's more, um community upgrades that I can get after that. Um, I am gonna need more Iridium bars. I'm also gonna have to get some more Solar Essence. So I guess we're going to town. Here. Occasionally you gotta give your wife a gift, chat. Otherwise, you lose uh, hearts. Don't do that. Uh, this game is called Stardew Valley. It is honestly one of the best games that's been released over the last 10 years. This is a uh, really fun experience if you've never played it before. The graphics may look a little bit, uh, a little bit dated, but the entire game is essentially made by one guy, which is kind of ridiculous. Just genuinely very impressive. Including the music and everything. The graphics of RuneScape aren't much better. Well, RuneScape is another amazing game.
Yeah, this guy basically lives the dream of any game developer. Exactly. Like, he worked on this game for probably, like, five years. I'm assuming in his spare time because he worked a regular job. And then he accidentally became, like, a multi-millionaire. <laughs> because his work is really sick. He's actually releasing another game sometime this year is when it's rumored. Did I stop playing StarCraft 2? Yeah, yeah, never playing that shitty game ever again. So wait, is Robin over here? Oh yeah, she is over here. Do you think Pam minds? Should I go tell her? Year three seems like a good year for an affair. <laughs> I mean, me, me and Marnie are getting real close. Me and Linus? Me and Pam. Cheating on your wife with her mom is a... <laughs> I think I've seen it in a video once. Wait, no, 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 no. What's going on, Predator? Um, I'm gonna sell some of the basic stuff. I think I saw it on x.com. Yeah. 